Well, Wayne and I are out in the boonies today, uh, a little farther away, and and uh, searching for a new spot to get some gold. We have come down here. This is an area that has bedrock from now until forever. You can see all this bedrock right here. Looking through the water, you can see the deep pools with bedrock all the way down. This whole area is nothing but bedrock and there are so many cracks and crevices to explore it's going to take us a very long time to uh, to work this entire area. What we've got is, I'll show you Wayne down, down on the bedrock down there, All right? The, uh, the way this stream is running right now, as we look upstream, you can see that there, the stream is kind of choked off upstream here. When it hits this point, it widens out, and right about where that uh, semi-dead tree is, uh, is sitting is about 50 feet away and the stream has widened out. Now I know when this thing gets running it really rips. So I'm 50 feet downstream from the uh, widening point and I'm looking at this big reef of bedrock right here. Right? That is going to channel the water down right through here into the spot that we have been digging. We have been cleaning some cracks out down right in here you can see we've done some cracking and crevicing here. Now we have gotten some very nice gold. As a matter of fact, we got a nice little nuggy down here. Uh, this is only about our what fourth trip to this area. Uh, we were basically snowed out early in the year, and uh, right now I am. because I've got a very nice drop. We've got the bedrock is fairly smooth running right over here and I'm running right down to this drop and at the end of the drop there was a nice accumulation of gravels and uh, some very big rocks down in here in this pool so I'm digging right down at the base of this drop and we will see if that uh, shows us any gold. I just finished classifying a bucket material to quarter inch and I'm going to take it over and run it in my California sluice box drop riffle sluice which is located straight over there. I don't know if you can see it because it's dead in line with me right here. But I'm going to have to run that over and uh, put it through the sluice. We'll see if any gold shows up. Well, didn't get much out of that half bucket and uh, so I messed around a little bit with some other cracks and only got some very very fine gold but possibly you can take a look at this I'm hoping that you can see it because I can see it in the uh, in the back of the camera here however that is a really nice little chunker and a little friend and I got those basically sniping right here on the bedrock so something new and different to do all right, well, we're going to call it a day. Didn't get a whole lot of gold today, but we had fun on the bedrock. That's what it's all about. Well, in an effort to uh, try and improve the video qualities here, what I have done is, ooh, man, I'm about to knock this over, is uh, use a magnifying glass with my video camera. So you can see the gold that I uh, got from this little excursion. And not bad gold. It's kind of nice and chunky. And uh, that's going to do it for the video for today. Let's see what else we got here. Yep, I think that's about it.